to today's video about the missions 9 and 10 from the DLC A Ranger's Life for Hunt Sim 2. If you enjoy the video, please leave me a like and subscribe. Thank you. I would have liked a nap, but duty calls. This afternoon, we should see if the bobcats have returned after the fire. Well, if someone burned your dog bed, where would you go? Okay, you'd sleep with me, but what about them? <laughs> yes, grump. I should take the Winchester. Okay, ready. There's an area of the forest that would make a nice new home for the Bobcats. Bertram's Pass. All this fog reminds me of the fire. The whole park would have been lost if it weren't for the firefighters' amazing work. This area is very similar to their old forest. I bet they'd like it here. Sent is strong to mark their territory. Find something! These tracks go in a straight line, and there are no claw marks because their claws are retractable. Bobcat has definitely been here. Let's find it! That's a bobcat cache. They hide food if they don't have time to eat it all. We should teach them to store food in boxes. What do you say, Darius? <laughs> Whoop yourself. Find something! The scent boy? I doubt we'll see a bobcat in the middle of the day, but I'll follow you. Go get it! Oh, forgot there was a cabin here. Loggers sometimes use it when they're working nearby. Wait here, boy. I'm going to take a quick look. Stay there! No one's been here in a long time. Ah! I believe our bobcat has moved in here. Let's check. He eats his meals here. Whew, fur, urine. Okay, this is definitely his home. Ooh, the loggers will need to find themselves another cabin. Oh, this photo. I remember this. The loggers invited us to eat with them. Look at Harry's long hair. Oh, okay, I've seen enough. I found an old photo of Harry. 
That was back when we were friends. But there's a hunting hide around here. Let's go there and wait for the bobcat. It's because of Harry that I started seeing Alice. <coughs> yep, it's true. Harry asked me to talk to Alice because he was nervous to do it himself. He wanted me to find out if she was interested in him. It was just like at school. So every day, I said all these nice things about Harry to Alice, and I would report back to Harry. But what did she say about me? <laughs> I'm not a matchmaker, Harry. You go speak to her. I kept telling him the same thing, but he never wanted to. And after a while, because we would see each other all the time, Alice and I got close. Huh. Human drama, huh? You can't understand a thing about it, and that's probably for the best. There's the hunting hive. Just have to wait. I should use some scent elimination spray. There. Now let's wait for our bobcat. Be a good boy now. A white-tailed deer. There he is. He looks healthy. He had a few burns from the fire, but the burn has grown back nicely. Where did that come from? Quick, where's my flashlight? See anything? Gunshots weren't aimed at the bobcat, they were far off. High caliber. Harry, come in. Get up. The shots came from southwest of here, toward Glenwood Peak. Let's take a look. It's just a female cougar. Sounds terrifying, I agree. We're getting close. I'll turn off the radio. Quiet now. We're here. Let's see if the shooters were here. Three by 62. That caliber can take down a lion. More cartridges. They came to hunt the park's predators. What's that? Uh, blood. Let's follow the trail. There's 
something on its hide. Fresh claw marks on its abdomen. There's also a large bite at the base of its neck. Uh, I think I know what was going on. The poachers were not hunting the elk, but the animal that was attacking it. Judging by the size of the wounds, it could only be a bear. A big one at that. Who's there? Show yourself! I'm a park ranger and armed! There! Lights! Stop! Darius, come! Come! Heal! They're fast. Damn. It's no use. Let's go back home. And I'll give a warning shot first so they remember I'm here. They don't know who they're dealing with. Harry, you there? Thanks for nothing, Harry. Let's go back. trying to call you all night. There were gunshots. Where? In the park. Where do you think? Where were you? I was in town because of you. B because of me? You're kidding, right? Because of the image file you sent me, Dexter. I couldn't read it, so I took it to a guy I know. And you couldn't email it? You can do all that online these days. It's not the 90s anymore. Did you transfer it to a floppy disk or what? Calm down. No, I'm fed up with your behavior. Who was the Night Ranger last night? Who? Me. So, where were you? I thought it would only take an hour, but it took longer. I bet you went to the bar again. Is feeling down always the excuse now? I wouldn't have to drink if you hadn't stolen the love of my life. The love of your life? <laughs> Give me a break. You just won't let it go, will you? Go to hell, Harry. I had to go out in the middle of the night, alone and with poachers there. They shot a 62 round at a bear. You still there? I'm here. They wounded an elk, but the bear ran off. I managed to chase him off after. They fled southwest. I had to put the elk down. It's starting to take a heavy toll. Well, people sometimes forget that hunting is prohibited at night. Did you hear anything I just said? Okay, Dexter, they weren't hunters. And yes, I should have come back earlier, but I really did take that file to my buddy because he's a paranoid nerd who only accepts deliveries by hand. Send me the file when it's ready. Yep. And Dexter, please keep the fact that there might be poachers to yourself. I wasn't planning to post it on social media. Now I can actually get some sleep. <laughs> <laughs> 